Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get um, Equus Pegasi. I am still pronouncing this wrong guys. Now first off, to efficiently spawn these like crazy, you're going to want to get a bunch of woven lassos. I find that this works better than food now because it actually is quicker. Uh, gains three hearts and only has a one second cooldown. Whereas with the food method, they actually changed it so it's a little bit harder um, the more, like, the fervor and taming you get. So we're just going to buy a whole bunch of these now. Just a quick collection show off here. These are all from grinding. And they all spawn pretty quickly because the chance to get a Pegasus appears to have gone up a bit. So they all spawned in pretty quickly, and they all spawned in in the same server. So basically what you do here, you head to the swamp, and you catch every single horse you see here, every single one of these, and you, as you can see you catch them pretty quickly with these lassos, and Pegasi tend to spawn in pretty quickly here actually. Like you will get um, a Pegasi from here, a lot quicker than you will with a regular horse or unicorn or gargoyle. I don't know why, but it seems to be the case. Especially when you catch all of these. And yesterday they did actually add in new manes and tails and patterns. So like we get like the flex pattern here, we get like a funeral ba funeral band mane main and tail we can get uh we can get full body stripes. In really rare cases, we can actually get a white one. I have a white one. Where'd he go? He is named after my Wild Horse Island's horse. My Wild Horse Island skewered. Because he looks just like him. Well, almost. But yeah, it's possible to get one that looks a lot like a zebra now because you can have one that spawns in as a white one with uh, full body stripes that are black. So they can look exactly like zebras now. After a while of catching these horses, you'll begin to notice that the swamp always stays highly populated, like he really heavily populated with these. That's because uh, Equus can't spawn anywhere else, they only spawn in the swamp. So instead of being all spread out like the regular horses do when you rapidly catch them, these guys will always stay in the swamp. So if any Pegasi spawn, you'll find them really, really quickly because this is a smaller area when compared to the rest of the map. So I could be over here catching a bunch of horses, and Pegasi could spawn on the other side of the swamp. But like, no worries, there's usually not very many people in the swamp since these don't since these uh, take a while to catch, people don't really want to catch them that much. But, um, if one does spawn, you should be able to get to it pretty quickly without worries of another person catching it. A white equus just spawned. Someone's catching it. Pretty one. Not the one I'm looking for though. The one I'm looking for, white one with full body stripes of some color. Um. But anyway, just make sure you have a bunch of lassos here. Uh, join a very small server so there's not as many people. Oop, I just lost my heart. No, come back! Okay. Yeah, make sure you're in a smaller server so that there aren't as many people trying to catch the horses. You should not be here. You do not belong here, horse. Why are you here? Seriously, why are you here? Um... Yeah, just catch as many horses as you can here. Pegasi should spawn pretty quickly. I've had five Pegasi spawn in the same server, all from just grinding here. Five Pegasi that I caught, to be more specific. Some other people caught some. Um, but yeah. Oh, this one's pretty. Sorry. Um...
But yeah, I would also recommend grinding here because the Equus uh, seem to uh, sell for a bit more than normal horses usually do. Like the minimum I see them sell for is $129, while the regular horses can be, can sell for lower than that. Oh, never mind, guys. 121 apparently. The lowest I've ever gotten was 129, but apparently they sell for 121. My bad, everybody. That the horse just wanted to prove me wrong here, guys. I'm going to give you a quick tip on how to join a smaller server. So first off, you go into the servers list on the game. Then you select uh, how you want your server to be. So you're going to go number of players ascending, and then you're going to click the option for exclude full servers. This is to get rid of, well, I mean, this is to get rid of like any private servers that could potentially show up on accident. This game doesn't support private servers, but you can just make a habit of clicking that for like other games as well. If you enjoyed today's video everyone, then please make sure to like and subscribe.